The tea is great. The tea party is great, but for desserts. Say no more. I'll get some. Only three cookies left, and they're chocolate chip, my favorite. Uh oh, now I need something for Roxanne. Dang it, there's gotta be some snacks somewhere in this house. Aha, a couch cookie. Is that a couch cookie? Is that a couch cookie? That looks like it's been under the couch for a year. You probably shouldn't eat that. I mean, I wouldn't even eat that. I'm giving it to my friend, Roxanne. But it's stale and moldy. Maybe she'll like it. Roxanne loves all kinds of cookies. I'm back. All I have for you is this cookie I found under the couch. Ah! Must not be a big fan of Snickerdoodles. I don't get it. My friends haven't came over in days. Maybe it's the new welcome mat. What? Welcome, Matt. Have you lost your mind? It's that old cookie you kept trying to give them. It's gone bad. Gone bad? Nonsense. Bring it here, Lana. Uh, why is it in a cage? Because it growled at me. I see it's a biter. Well, so am I. Now let's see how bad you are. No, no. Stay. At a girl. There, there. See, good enough to eat. Oh, an ambulance. Now then. Lana, make sure you leave that cookie for me. Not done with it yet. She still wants to eat the cookie? Like I said before. Even I wouldn't need it. Well, Lola, you gave us quite a scare. So, am I gonna be okay, Doc? Well, if you don't want to take your, if you don't want to take my word for it, let's just check your chart. Let's see here. Oh no, oh no, this is terrible. Everything okay, Doc? Don't touch me. That's not a good sign. Oh no, it's great Grandma Harriet. Your time has come, Lola Loud. I'm not Lola. I'm, uh... Haley? Flower. Yeah, that's it. Oh, sorry. I must have the wrong room. Excuse me, nurse. Yes? I'm looking for Lola Lau. Oh, she's in that room right over there. <gasps> no, that's Haley Flower's room. Haley Flower? Stop. You could fool your grandma, huh? What do you want from me? I'm here to escort you to the 
to the resting place where all bad folks go. The stinky pit. The stinky pit? Why do I have to go there? I'm not a bad girl. But you selfish. And being selfish is a terrible thing. Next stop, the stinky pit. Ha 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 ha! Here we are. Ew, why does it smell so bad? The guy who made this pit throws all kinds of stinky stuff in here. It's called the stinky pit for a reason. Now get in! Uh, <laughs> Please, Grandma Harriet, I don't want to go in there. I'll do anything. Please give me another chance. Oh, come on, Lola. Show a little dignity. Daddy! All right, stop your crying. Give you another chance. Really? Yes, you are my granddaughter, but you must always be generous, never selfish. You've got it, Grandma. I miss Lola so much. Me too. We can only hope that she gets better. I don't want to lose my baby girl. Found Lola's old mirror. Lori, you should be going through Lola's stuff. She won't like it. Guys, doctor said Lola's not coming back. I miss her too. If she's not gonna, but if she's not gonna be here, I might as well take some of her things. Hello, my wonderful family. <gasps> Lola, you're alive. I'm so happy you're back. Guys, isn't this too good to be true? It's good to have you back, sis. We totes missed you. Glad. Glad you're back, sweetie. We're all happy to see you again. I missed all of you, too. And you know, being sick made me do a lot of thinking. I've been really greedy in the past, but no more. From now on, you're looking at the new and improved, non-selfish Lola Lau. Hey, Roxanne, you're one of my bestest friends, and there's something I've wanted to give to you. What is it? One of my Miss Beauty dolls. Wow, thanks, Lola. I thought you were a selfish brat. I was, Roxanne. I was. Hey, who wants more desserts? Yeah! Hey, big brother. Are those desserts done yet? Almost. Say, where's Lori? She's getting a makeover in your room. I mean, the beauty salon. Excuse me, do you have any wine, Lola? There should be some in the garage cooler. And here's a free doll just for you. Um, thanks.
Lola, how's it going, girl? OMG, Lori, I love your new hair. Thanks. Now I'm gonna go get a massage from Lenny. Okay, take it easy. Hey, Elise, are you enjoying your ride in my princess car? Absolutely. I've never felt so alive. Glad you're having fun, little sis. Look at all these happy faces. It sure feels good to be generous. Hey, sis, this, is this party great or what? It sure is. Here's your mail, Lola. Thanks, Mom. You look lovely. Were you at the beauty salon? As a matter of fact, I was. An overdue library bill? Okay, let's see what the damage is. Only $50? It's not so bad. Just, I'll just get out my wallet. And there's no money here because I gave it all to my friends. <laughs> How delightful. Mom, worried about Lola. Me too, sweetie. Gee, honey, are you sure you're sure are taking your total bankruptcy well? Oh, it's just a bad dream. I'll wake up. I'll wake up soon. A dream? Yeah, I'm still in the hospital, sleeping like Lily. Um. Checked out of the hospital for this morning. Here's the bill. You mean I'm awake? Ah! -ha! Give me back my money. Give me my doll back, you freeloader. Ride over. Rides over, cheap skate. Oh boy, this is my lucky day. A gold coin. Your luck just ran out, bub. Hey, he's back, Lola, for crushing my arm. Unhand that coin, or the arm comes off. Ah! That little display of selfishness just earned you a spot in this stinky pit for eternity. I'm not selfish. I'm not selfish. I'm selfless. You almost tore my arm off for a coin. Thanks, Lincoln. I knew I could count on you. Well, deal's a deal. Let's go. Now wait a gosh darn second. Who dares back sass great grandma Harriet? That would be me. Lana back sass loud. I say you've got the wrong girl. This girl is the most generous, big hearted, non selfish girl in the whole world. She'd sell your soul for a jar of glitter. Bet she wouldn't. Got yourself a deal. Okay, Lola, I'll let you stay. But first, help me settle a bet. If you had to choose between your twin sister and all the jar of glitter I, I just so happened to have in my pocket, which would you choose? That depends. The color is the glitter. Lola! Pink. I'll take the glitter. Lola! 
Here you go, Lola. A jar of pink glitter. Next stop, Stinky Pit. Ah! Look, guys. Glitter! Lola, what is wrong with you? How can you trade your own sister for a jar of glitter? I think I could have gotten more. She stood up for you and sold her, and you sold her out. You should totes be ashamed of yourself. <gasps> what have I done? <laughs> I want another chance. I didn't learn anything. I lost my favorite twin sister. I don't want this stupid glitter. I want Lana back. Here. Take her! You heard what I just said, what I said about the glitter? Yes, and your sister really enjoys the stinky pit. It's no fun if it won't make their, if it won't make her miserable. What do you expect? It's Lana. Well, I guess you learned your lesson. I'm out of here. Uh, hey Lana? About trading you for glitter? Say no more, Lola. I would have done the same. You would have? No. <laughs>